We want to give a shout out to Butterfly Dolls. Thanks for the request and just craft it. For Gabriella's creative studio backdrop, you will need a few supplies on hand. You'll need this foam board. We got a two pack from Michaels. It's 18 inch by 24 inches and there are two pieces inside the perfect size for her backdrop. Now if you can't get foam board, you can still use cardboard, just make sure it's similar in size. You'll also need scrapbook paper, we have a mirror, a regular brick, a whitewash brick, and some printables from our blog. We have these letter stickers to decorate and a jumbo glue stick. You'll need plenty of glue. We have tape to attach the boards together, and last you'll need craft paint. Start by taking your foam board pieces and create a trifold. You'll need to cut one of the pieces in half to give you two smaller pieces for the side. This way you can open it and close it. So you'll have one regular size in the middle and then the two that are cut in half on each side. Now the American Girl version only has one, but since we have this piece, we're gonna go ahead and add both. That way it's a little bit bigger also. We want it to be able to open and close for easier storage options. To do that, you need to place the pieces side by side and then take your tape and tape them together, only on one side though. This way it can open and close. Now completely cover one side with your brick scrapbook paper. We're using a glue stick, applying it directly to the board and the paper just to make sure it sticks. When you're done applying the brick scrapbook paper, this is what the entire wall should look like. It's just the outside of the building, so it's all brick. Now turn it to the back side, and this will be the inside of the studio. So we're gonna use the whitewash brick. However, on this side, you have to be extra careful when putting the scrapbook paper on, especially the corners. Completely close the trifold, and then apply the scrapbook paper, making sure to add it on the inside fold. So it should be in the corners just like this. That way when you open it, you're not tearing your paper. So it can open easily if you have it in the crease. Once the studio walls are up, you can add details to the wall, like this window in the studio looking to the outside. You'll see another brick building and also her stereo sitting right here. We're also gonna add the radiator. All you have to do is print the printable from our blog at AmericanGirlIdeas.com and use a glue stick to put it in place. Now glue your mirror to the center piece of the trifold and then add your letters. Gabriella's mirror says, listen to your art. Add any other details you'd like, like these speakers, any stickers of hearts or stars, and maybe even some stage lights. Now this side is complete. Now going back to the outside brick wall, get your paint ready. You have this entire brick wall to paint anything you want. Gabriella's wall has three hearts, so that's what we're gonna paint. Now you have a beautiful creative studio backdrop for your dolls. Give us a thumbs up if you think this looks like Gabriella's and leave us a comment with what other props we should add to make this set complete. <laughs>